Ready? Let's go! Rubber brood mother! Look at it. Look at it. Oh, that is so epic! It is so incredibly cool. What's up, guys? It's King Daddy D Mac, and welcome! Welcome back to another episode of Ark Survival Evolved! That's right. We're playing here with, yeah, Ark Corrupted Overloaded. It's quite a long name, isn't it? I don't know. I think it's getting a new name in ASA. But anyway, yeah, so much fun doing flips. My goodness. How's everybody doing today? I hope you're doing well because me personally, I'm doing pretty amazing. You might not think so after last episode when we took on... That dang dirty Volcanus brood bother. It absolutely mopped the floor with us and our creatures. Yeah, kind of sad phase, uh, but we can rebuild. It's okay. I think I learned a couple things from that. For one, the mod author told me actually today that while in vanilla, the brood mother is one of the easiest bosses in his mod. It's one of the hardest. Yeah, at least amongst the elementals. So that's telling me, you know, we we might have had it a little easy against the gorilla. And I think we definitely need to suit up with most likely something stronger than Allosaurus. We, pro we probably need to get Rexes. Um, it also tells me that if I did continue with Allosaurus, definitely got to use saddles and all that sort of stuff. We went saddleless, no levels, and that just didn't quite cut it. So... Why don't we go searching for some Rexes today? I did do some grinding and um, I do have loads of resources so that if we wanted to, we could look at the poop towers. Is that such a funny thing about Ark? Seriously, um, we could get another constellation boss if we so wanted. I do have the powder now to do so, but uh, there's something else I actually had my eyes on. We still might do that, but... I kind of not super impressed by him. Plus, the mod author said he's still working on the Thyla and uh, in the next update, the Thyla will be better. So I don't know. Kind of tells me maybe we shouldn't continue with the Thyla. So that would mean we'd have to do at least two because we're trying to get a breeding pair or or, I, you know, it's possible that the current version of the Thyla could end up getting like wiped out and it would be pointless. So I think we're going to hold off on that. I did learn the Carcanos is actually the best of the constellations if we want to do one. But um, yeah, something you got to knock it out the same way you do in vanilla, which we could do. But it's kind of pain in the butt and I'm just not in the mood for it right now today. So that all being said, we also lost our RG. We lost like so much last episode, but we lost our RG. But hey, no harm, no foul. We do have more. Remember, we bred to get that one. And uh, yeah, it's got a lot of brothers and sisters. So boom, we have Rodan 2.0. Let's go ahead. You can take your uh, fallen brother. I don't remember if it was a male or female, but your fallen brothers or sisters saddle. And look at that. No harm, no foul. We did waste a lot of time with leveling, but it does already have levels because they do get levels while just chilling in the soul balls. So that's cool. That is very cool. Let's go ahead, pack you up. And the next thing, we still have the core, which I already crafted for the next Leo for the next Thyla. Well, I found out something. I don't know when we unlocked this exactly or if we maybe just unlocked it. But uh, there's another set of armor that's even better. And it's really not that expensive. At least I think so. It says uh, uh, Constellation Corrupted Armor. Uh, everything is corrupted. Even your hands, arms, blah, blah, blah. Okay, so it doesn't really tell us what it does. But we know all the other armors gave us buffs. So maybe this armor would be better. Let's go ahead, craft the Constellation. It, it at least... It goes up to 50 armor instead of uh, instead of 25. All right, is that all of them? I kind of missed track if I crafted them all. All right, so that's all but the boots. The boots are kind of interesting. Um, where are the boots? Where are the boots? There we go. Um, they say they take an active constellation core. Well, that just happens to be what this is, I believe. 
So does this now mean? Ha ha. All right. Um, let's go ahead. Let's craft up another pair of elemental corrupted. I think that's what it wants. There we go. And we got the boots. Awesome. All right. Maybe, maybe, just maybe this stuff is even better. So let's let's check this out. So currently, this is what it gives us. So gains 15% movement speed, 10% melee, 20% torpor reduction. I don't know what the other one does. It doesn't really matter. Let's go ahead and put this on. Oh, weird. Oh, ooh, crap. All right. What is... Oh, that's super weird. All right. What does this now? So it is giving us a buff. And it says 15% melee, which I think it was 10. 20%. Uh, okay. And yeah, I think that I think that is a boost. And does it also do it for the creature? Um, here you go. Let's let's boost you. All right, I like to do 200. I think pretty much I just did that in melee. Let's go ahead. And let's just do that for now. I'll worry about the other stuff later. Maybe a few into a few into carry weight. We still have more levels to go. All right, so can we see now? What does the armor give us? So. Rider Imperate, okay, 15% extra damage. Whereas, let's put on the others. And, uh, where'd it go? 10%, okay, so it does, in fact, it gives a boost. I'm gonna believe it's all the same, but it gives an extra 5% or thereabouts for everything. So that's awesome. Um, Let's go ahead, we can swap our crown. And we'll put this armor, just in case we need it for something else. It doesn't weigh that much. Let's go ahead and put that there. Awesome. So, hey, I already feel better. And it's kind of weird. I become kind of like a constellation creature. That is super duper weird. I kind of like it. I don't know. You can kind of in the gloves, you can see your, your hands or arms a little bit. I think that's super neat. I like it. I don't know. I'll take it. I'll take it. It's better armor regardless. And we could always put another skin on it. Anyway, um, today the plan is, as you may be able to see, I crafted up a crap ton of elemental kibble because I, in anticipation, realized we have a lot that we have to get going on. Um, We are falling behind, especially because we did not defeat the boss last time. So, um, let me just see. I think I have in one of these. Nope, nope, nope. I think we need to go out and we need to hunt down the Rexes. Please tell me I grabbed the normal. Okay, normal stone gates. All right, awesome. Let's go hunt down ideally a shiny, which should be pretty easy to find with the shiny finder. Let's see if we can get, we need to get either an Ignis or a Fulman, I believe it's called, um, Rex. And ideally a pair, but let's worry about the good one first. So wish me luck, guys. Oh, it should be quite a day. And who knows? Maybe we can even get an army already today. I probably have to I have to check if we can even make another brood mother right now, but we'll do the best that we can. So wish me luck and also just let me remind you to show that amazing support for the series by smashing that thumbs up button. If you're new to the channel or you haven't yet, seriously, what are you waiting for? It is the perfect time to subscribe. Also, please, please, please come check out the Discord. You're all welcome. The link is down in the channel description. And uh, yes, we still do have an ACO server that is up, is live, is running. And anyone that is a YouTube member or a Twitch subscriber or a Prime Twitch subscriber, that's if you have Amazon Prime, you get a free uh, Twitch sub every single month. You're not using it. You're losing it. So all these things that gets you invited to the server. But of course, everyone is welcome on the Discord. So pretty cool. Anyway, wish me luck, guys. I'll see you hopefully at an Epic Rex. Holy crap, guys, 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 look at, look at, look at, look at, oh, this is what we want. This is exactly what we want. Um, Let's see if we can get this guy surrounded so that we can freely tame him and do whatever we want. Oh, come on, bro. Oh, crap, I forgot, I forgot. He's a shocker. He's a shocker one. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. All right. Maybe, maybe he's trapped. I, I can't tell. I don't know. Okay, I definitely didn't trap him. Definitely, definitely didn't trap him. All right, come on. Oh, maybe I just trapped myself. This is like trapception. 
What can I say? Oh, God. All right, watching my health. I'm doing okay. I believe I do have, like, resistance to him. Oh, wait. Whoa, 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 whoa. These guys have way too much. Uh, all right, let's do this properly the way we're supposed to do it. Uh, kind of. Oh, I hate that these guys cannot go backwards. All right, let's see if we can get them in there. Come here, buddy! We gotta be careful, because if there's one of those anime dudes, it's not gonna be... It's not gonna end well. All right. Um, but, oh, crap. We only have one left. Oh, dude! Dude, what are you doing, my dude? Come on. Come on! Dude, no! Come on, this way, this way, this way. I think these guys don't like to pathfind two flyers when they're in the air. Come on. I really would like to get them trapped because I don't know. Oh, no, 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 no. This is bad. This is bad. Come on. Yep. Yep. Come on. Oh, this is bad. This is not good at all. Not in the tiniest little bit. All right. You know what? Maybe, maybe we, uh, maybe we're doing going about this wrong. Oh, oh, come on. Oh, he keeps losing aggro. Come on. All right. He's got our aggro. I'm not feeling good about that Dilo. All right. You know what? Forget this. Forget this. Let's switch off. Let's go to our, our knocker router. All right. Um, let's just carry all that. You did good. Whoa. You did good, bro. I should actually have him on my shoulder, but what you going to do? Where's Blue Jay? Oh, not good. Not good. Tell me I brought Blue Jay. Oh, it's right there. I'm so blind, guys. All right. We got Blue Jay. All right. Uh, oh. Come on. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Come on. All right. So we got to keep laying into him like a lot. Come on. And the torpor won't go on until we stop pretty much. Come on, dude. But if we stop too early, he might run, which would be not good. Oh, come on. I'm surprised it hasn't gone off yet. Uh... Come on. This is my... All right. Come on. That should that should take him out, I assume, right? It should get a blast of Torpor soon, right? There we go. All right. Beautiful. Uh, what's that? I saw red. All right. We got to hurry with this. Let's, let's not dilly-dally. Okay. So, um, it said, I think, 13... All right. Come on, bro. Just do your thing. 13. That's correct. Do your thing. We need you. All right. And it's a female, too. That's good. And. Come on. Come on. I don't know where that Dilo went. You can do it. And. Yes. All right. Well, at least it worked out in the end. So. A little rusty in that. We haven't t actually like tamed something like that in a little while. Definitely could have been done uh, a little smoother, but in the end, you know, we we pulled it off. So that's all that matters. All right, let's me go ahead pack up all our taming stuff because we still got another to tame today. I think we have it, guys. I think we have it. I just got to check what gender it is. Hold on. Uh, get out of here, Raptor. Oh, baby. What is that? All right. I don't know if the raptor will bother us. Oh, it's a male. Okay, perfect. This is what we actually want. We're not on the... Oh, my lag. We're not on the correct amount, though. We got to we gotta swap. We got to pull a swap really quick. Oh, crap. All right. Um, there's one of those raptor things. Oh, that could be very bad, actually. All right. Come on. Uh, oh, I thought I just got the raptor. Didn't I just get you? What the crap, dude? All right, come on. Keep on going. Oh, okay. Phew, that's the Bronto. <laughs> I saw the Bronto's health or somebody's health. I don't know. I saw somebody's health and I thought it was this guy's health. 
And okay, it's out. Oh god. Oh god. Oh, we gotta hurry. Oh god, we gotta hurry. How many kibble? How many kibble? Um, two. Yes. Uh, one, two. Well, things are distracted. We we gotta hurry. Come on. Yes. All right. All right. All right. All right. All right. Let me get you. Where is it? Where the crap is it? Come here, Rex. Did I get him? Okay, I got him. I got him. Let's get the crap out of here. Holy crap! That could have been so bad. Oh, let me just confirm. Yes. Male and female, baby. That is what I'm talking about. What kind of brood mother is this? I maybe... Did it even survive? Did a stupid Bronto take him out? Hold on. All right. Um, Let's go ahead. Oh, oh, oh. Do I have the setting to do that? Okay, it does. All right, all right, cool. Let's get this guy out. It's so funny. After playing the hunted, I get I get rusty on all of our modded stuff because I'm so not <laughs> I'm not used to it. I'm like, where's my guy? It doesn't even occur to me that he's on my shoulder. All right, all right, we got this. Come on, you dumb brood mother. We need all the I think venom it was or something. I don't know, but we need it. We probably need it. Let's go. Yeah, you squeal, you little spider. All right. Awesome. If we have to do more, brood mothers are always one of the most common. But I think we're good. I think we are good. We still got plenty of kibble, too, if we run across anything else. But we got to start that breeding immediately so that uh, we can, you know, level up our racks. But of course. All right. And we must not forget, before we start the mass breeding, enable mating behavior enable mating we have got to get a pair of them that are at the same level which of course we can use best eggs for so it shouldn't be a big deal let's go let's go let's see which one's the female yeah so normally this is what the full min would look like it's the electric type um but because we got a jungle shiny one it's green which is kind of interesting all right, so we just go right in here and go. All right, so this is actually all we need, I think. Make best. All right, beautiful. That is all we need. Let's go ahead and go behavior, disable mating. And behavior, disable mating. Awesome. All right, uh, we just got to wait for the egg to be ready to hatch. So I'll see you right back once that's the case. All right, here it is. And three, two, one. Bada boom. Awesome. All right, so let's go ahead and get our new male, which is our best of the best male. You, sir, can go in here. Bada boom and bada boom. Epic. Oh, that's nice, too, that it got, it ended up getting the male's colors. All right, so... Behavior, enable mating, behavior, enable mating, awesome. And now it is just going to be a waiting game until, you know, we actually get the upgraded one. It's just occurring to me, though, I, I can't remember, was was the Allosaur the Ignis one or was it the Fullman? I can't remember. Awesome. All right. That should get auto picked up. I'll pick it up and throw it over here anyway. Bada boom. It will hatch that one out. We can always, you know, try it out briefly. I still already have saddles left over. And I'm determined. I want to get to this today. Um, Let me just see, though. Uh, How would I be able to tell? I got to look where our allosaurs are. Where do we have them? That'll tell me immediately. My goodness. Takes so long. All the metadata. All right. Those are RGs. Are these all RGs? All RGs. All right. I'll figure it out. I We might have to take on the dragon, in which case I got to figure out what exactly do we need for the dragon to spawn it in. So we'll see. Be right back. Oh, am I happy? This one went quick. Like, Usually doesn't go this quick, but this one went quick. Look at already. We've got Glacius Rex and Glacius Rex, which, by the way, this is the one for the dragon, I do believe. 
Anyway, thanks to the best eggs. This could could have been extra complicated. Um, we got a female. All right, let's find out if we can change it to a male. Okay, it claims that it did. I don't know if it actually does. So this will be interesting. If it actually did turn one of them into a male, we're basically done with this Rax. I still want to go and continue to hunt to see if we can find... I, I'd want to get that brood mother if possible, but I don't know. We might have to wait. We may have to wait. I'll see you back in a few seconds. All right. Just seven more, six more, five more, four, three, two, one seconds to go. And... Oh, they're pretty. All right. Please, please, please have swapped the... No, it didn't. Crap. Crap, crap, crap. All right. We're not out of the woods yet. We did get two females. That's pretty cool, but not out of the woods. We got to set them back to breeding again. Enable mating and behavior. Enable mating. Stupid things. Let's go ahead and get a hitching post so that we can continue to hunt while they continue to breed. Oh, I was so close. I really thought we had it, guys. I thought we had it. All right. Um, hitch dinos. We want T-Rex, T-Rex. All right. Awesome. While that's a going, um, let's continue to hunt. Let's see if we can maybe knock out at least one of those. Uh, so we need Ignis Rex. That's the only one left. Let's see if we can knock out one of them today. Oh, baby. The shiny finder, actually, I was about to give up, and then I went and checked it again, and it looks like there's actually a new one that spawned in. Oh, this is perfect. Come on, come on, where are you? It should be. It says that it's around this area. Where are you? How hard is it to find a Rex? Seriously, bro? Oh, no. I'm not seeing one. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, these these stupid things right here drive me nuts. Oh, crap. Get out of here. I don't know. This is not looking good. It says that it should be here, but I'm not seeing it here. Uh, If it is here, we, we definitely want to lead it away from here. All right, come here, Dota Rex. I need to get the levels back up on my RG. Come on. You sneak butt. Come on. It's only level 35. Oh, man. I want this. Oh, oh, that's a good sign. The fact that that guy's on fire right now. He got bit by an Ignis something. I just don't know if it's a Rax. All right, get out of here. All right, what is Ignis around here? All right, Terror Bird definitely got to go. Oh, that's a good sign. That is definitely a good sign. All right, not a bad sign yet. All right, let's pop up here. Oh, all right. Oh, I don't think those anime ones do anything. I'm not seeing a Rex. I'm not seeing a Rex anywhere. Crap. All right, let me recheck the shiny finder because this is not looking good. Full Mincarno, 150, not bad. Let's go snag this guy. Awesome. Yeah, not looking good, guys. Not looking good. Hold on, hold on. Can we see anything? I don't want to give up yet, but we might have to. Oh, man. I'm so mad. It's not on the shiny finder anymore. It's a goner. It is a goner. What do you think about that, huh, brood mother? Makes me so mad. I tell you, these elementals, they get wiped out quick. Ooh, don't dismount by mistake. There was an interesting brood mother that I saw in the shiny finder. I don't know. Like, I've been told the, the bosses, even, like, we can tame this guy right here. I don't know if we can afford to tame him, but, you know, it is tameable. Um, I've heard they're really not that good. Um, and I think one of the things might be, it might be that when you breed it, because obviously you'd want to, I would assume, make it like a tier two elemental. 
And I think when you breed the bosses, if you even can, I might be wrong about this, that they like get weaker or they start at level one or something weird like that. I don't know. So I just haven't bothered. Ooh, look at you. I still never tamed one of these things. It's kind of cool though. Come here. Get. Ooh, look at you, you giant. You know, maybe I should do that sometime just for funsies. Probably should. Um, all right. I do want to see because it is one of my favorite shiny types. I'm just kind of curious as to how much actual uh, kibble it would require and if we could do it. Come on. It's funny is it's actually like the worst type. Like it's an awesome shiny type, but it's kind of like not particularly a is beneficial. It's a broodmother one, but it, it's a rubber broodmother, basically. It's it's just not as good as it could be. Ooh, Ignis one. All right. Um let's go let's go at least lay eyes on it. I have to see what a rubber broodmother looks like. You know what's pretty funny? It's literally right here, right where uh I stopped. That's the rubber one. Come on into the light, buddy. Five elemental boss things. It is an Ignis. I want to hear you boy. Oh, it looks kind of cool as you get close. And it's kind of stuck. All right. Um, Let's see what you actually need to make a boss taming rune just for funsies. I think that would be epic. All right, on the bright side, we did get two more Glacius eggs. So, in the third one, I'm hatching out another one of those. So, maybe we need to get a male. Let's see, let's see. So, we've got already two, not one, but two females. Okay, bada bing, bada boom. And yes, three females and a male. Awesome. That is what I wanted to see. All right, let's get uh, these two packed up. Look at their poo towers. All right. Bada bing, bada boom. Let's get it. This is actually perfect. I was trying to uh, look up what we needed. Oh, it's so cool. It's a little washed out because of my crazy lamps. So it's actually the lighting's weird. I don't know. It's different on every map. But anyway, um, let's go ahead and go. Hitch dinos. Let's get them all hitched up. Awesome. And let's go. Uh, behavior. Enable mating on every single one. You know, I still, even to this day, when, you know, I'm going in my memory banks, I want to say enable wandering. Even to this day. It's so funny. That was so long ago. Most of you probably don't even know what that crap I'm talking about. But that it used to be that you had to say wandering on every creature. All right. So that's a going. Um, this is our army. We need to find out, though, with the dragon. And we'll try them out. Don't you worry. Um, with the dragon, though, can we afford it? Let's go uh, back. I, uh, I basically I had to leave the terminal. I was looking for it. Um, let's see. Beaver. I had to leave the terminal there, I believe, because we never defeated the Broodmother, and I had to wait for it to despawn, which I assume it would have despawned by now, right? I'm pretty sure they had a, a boss timer. I don't see it, so... Dude, imagine if it, like, followed me all the way home. My base was gone when I got back. That would be so bad. All right, this is empty, right? All right, so what do we actually need for this? If we were to do the dragon... So we need eight dragon teeth, five mana. Oh, crap. That might be a problem. So in one of the updates that the mod author did, which he still has not fixed yet, I wish he would fix. Um, I think mana cores don't naturally spawn on this map. Maybe they never did. I don't know. I can't. To be honest, I can't recollect ever seeing a mana core. But that's not good, because that basically means, assuming that's the only way to get it, that means we're not going to be able to... Oh, are you serious? I flew all the way back for that stupid loot thing, and it, it was gone. Thank you. Thank you, game. Thank you. Just what I needed. I know what we're going to do. Um, 
I suppose I could spawn in some mana core just, you know, to make up for it, but we're not going into a whole nother map just for that. So we'll see. Complications, complications, but let's take it one step at a time. I'm such a dummy sometimes. I got back to the base and I was so excited about the Glacius eggs. I totally forgot about that brood mother. Um, so I went, I checked elemental boss taming runes is what it said it took five of. And I think we should have enough. Um, let's just make sure it didn't craft more. Okay. Crafted one. I should have everything in here. It's kind of annoying that I can't just press A to craft them all. But what you going to do? All right. We got five. Beautiful. Let's go see if we can tame this sucker because um, I don't know how I'm going to deal with the dragon today. To be completely honest with you, um, I haven't decided yet. I, I forgot to check if I had mana cork wells, but I'm going to have to look into that. I might need to add simple spawners to the mod pack if I don't already have it in there. I got to figure out what the code is. I got to do a lot of stuff. So we'll we'll get ready for it but anyway this is something here right now which why not let's get our first boss i we haven't never done this yet all right should be just right down here yes it actually moved over i think all right this is this is potentially a good thing um because we do not want it getting involved with other guys um i'm gonna see if i can trap it really quick just just to try and keep it a bit oh man i gotta remember i gotta build the trap first and then lead them into it not i don't know this might work though this might actually work oh my god oh my god i feel what is this server lag why is it so dumb is it not like dude look at that it's it's stuck it's stuck yes i wonder if it like because I'm a volcanic one, it's like, I don't know if it it's like, no, we're friends. I've just made that up out of my head. I doubt that's the case, but you never know. What if? What if? All right. It does seem peculiar that it's not aggroing. It also could be because it doesn't pathfind to me. No, it, it doesn't seem to care about me. It also, I wonder if the armor does something. All right, anyway, let's swap up, pick up. Let's confirm that it's five kibble and that I didn't just read that wrong. Yeah, five. All right, let's hope that the shiny finder is correct. Let's also hope that this... Whoa, it boinged me away. Dude, I love this. This is so cool. Whoa. This is so funny. Come on. Dude, look at this. This is going to be awesome. So anything that hits me is going to boing off. You know, I really... Oh. Remember I told you about the breeding, how it doesn't... It's like not as good. All right. Keep on going. It's pretty beefy. It's got 70,000 Torpor, though. This is kind of the only disturbing thing. Come on. I think that's a lot of Torpor. I don't know. I think that is. I think that's actually an insane amount of Torpor now that I think about it. Thankfully, though, it I don't think it can really hit us up here. Root Mother's always had it kind of kind of bad, you know? All right. Doing good. I don't know if my bulk Torpor mount has gone off on it yet. It doesn't usually until you stop. It's such an interesting mechanic. I don't know that I've ever seen that before where it stacks like that. It's kind of neat, but it leaves you guessing. Unless, I'm sure if you did the math, you could figure it out, but no thank you. Funny enough, I used to be good at math. Used to be. Keyword, used to be. Back in my, my school days, you know, when there's dinosaurs. Maybe that's why I took to this game so much. All right. Come on. It's so silly. I got to say, like, this is the type of thing where it's just like genius, pure genius. People say Hexen's a genius. No, 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 no. Shiny Dino's mod. Genius. Absolute genius. Oh, I love it so much. 
All right, this snake is kind of OP. Come on. All right, it's not a good sign that I can't even knock out a snake. That is a beefy snake. <gasps> it's knocked out. No, 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 no. Oh, no, 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 no. Come here, snake. Dude, the snake's like, stu this is bad. Snake. Oh, crap. Oh, this is not good at all. Let's just make sure it hasn't already been hit. Are you serious? How are we going to maneuver this? What can I do? Maybe this? Oh, it's it's knocked out. Okay, that's not a bad thing. Five and bada boom, bada boom. Ooh, oh, is it gonna take all five? That's some weird sounds. I feel like it didn't take all five, but maybe it did. We did it! We have a bird mother. We still need a saddle for it, but hey, I'll take it. Good enough for me. Move! Good enough for me. All right, let's swap mounts. And let's go have some fun. Let's see if we can make this saddle. It's kind of cool. Uh, oh, imagine if it actually was good. Because it is an Ignis. I don't, I don't even know if they have tier twos for the bosses. But it's kind of neat. It's kind of neat. All right, so I'll see you back at the base. All right, we're back. And... Uh, Let's go ahead, do a few things. Let's see what the boss armor takes. I assume it's a generic boss armor. Yep. All right. We can definitely afford that. Yes. I was a little worried about fiber. It's been a hot second since I went out and got fiber. Um, let's also grab... Do I still have the Rex? Yes. All right. Awesome. Um, let's grab one of these Rexes. All right. One of the ones with mate boost. Let's give you a saddle. Let's grab her. Awesome. And let's go try all these out. I think this should be pretty cool. So uh gotta keep in mind oh, actually we don't have to do it that way. We gotta keep in mind though, the um let's do it right here. Keep in mind the brood mother does not have mate boost. Whereas, you know, the Rex and stuff does. It's also first tier elemental. But anyway. Where is it? There it is. Finally, something that has an icon. I was, I like, I couldn't find it because I was looking for something without an icon. All right, bada boom. Let's put in a teleporter, a picker up thing. All right, let's pick it back up, throw it back out just to make sure that it works correct. All right, awesome. So being a rubber type, I think the Xanax, I, I don't know what that means. I have no clue. I think it's just a coloration thing, but let's see. Watch this. Oh, it bounces! That is so awesome. That is so cool. All right, what is this type of thing hit for? That's a trike. Dude, are you kidding me? 11 damage, 12 damp. All right, uh, decent DPS. Let's see, any other moves? Oh, it does like no damage though, which kind of sucks. It's definitely, it feels good. Just the damage on, and like we got a boosted level, you know, when you, you gotta take that into consideration. All right, one fireball went like way the other way. All right, those are stegos. All right, what does it do in the water? Is it a, oh, it stays in the, no, it kind of like, does it walk in the water? I can't tell. I can't tell if it was like just hovering just above the ground or what. All right, does catch guys on fire because of the type it is. It feels good though. That's like the moral of the story. It just could use a lot more power unless there's something I'm not taking into consideration. Dude, that melee is horrible. No wonder it does like nothing. But it is again, a first heal tier elemental. Oh my God. I mean, it's not really much harder to tame than like a normal guy is. So I can see why it shouldn't be like crazy overpowered. 
Well, it's cool. I like it. You just, I think you can't, you gotta curb your expectations to exactly what it is. It's pretty tanky. And that really is decent DPS. You just, you'd expect it would immediately one shot. I mean, that was only level 20. You'd expect it would immediately one shot everything. You know what I'm saying? And that is awful for health boost. But it's still cool. The fact that it's a rubber type is just so awesome. Get wrecked. And again, also no mate boost. All right, we'll have to figure that out. I do, just for funsies, I'm, I mean, I'm a little afraid. But just for funsies, I kind of wouldn't mind taking it, uh, you know, off, like jumping off something super high. Because that's why we got this. That's why it is so dang awesome and cool. And did I grab both? I got to grab the other Rex saddle. Because I want to try out both the Rexes, the uh, Fullman and the Glacial. We don't have a lot of time left. So I got to kind of hurry with this. Let's see. I had one more, right? Perfect. And I have the other Rex. I think I had... I threw out a third egg, and I think I never grabbed it. Ooh, they're doing awesome. Oh, no. It should... I'm confused. I'm super confused. Did I already pick it up? Yep, there it is. All right, perfect. We're golden. All right, let's go jump off somewhere high, and then let's run around and try our racks. All right, I'm headed to the highest spot that I could find. It's kind of rough because <laughs> there's some really bad stuff around these places like that. I'm pretty sure that's not a normal dragon. Oh, no, it is. Dragoon. All right, let's go ahead. Uh, I hope I don't die doing this. Not from the fall damage, but, you know, from whatever I land on. It's worth it, though. I mean, what else? What else would we use this thing for? It's so cool. All right, ready? Let's go! Rubber Broodmother! Look at it. Look at it. Oh, that is so epic! Yes. Rubber. Broodmother! It is so incredibly cool. It bounces funny. Suit. Oh, crap. Oh, go away, Carno. Don't. There's nothing to look at here. <laughs> Is that the silliest thing? I mean, I'll be honest. I would have much rather just about any other boss than this one to get a rubber one with. But I will take it. I will definitely take it. I think it is super. Oh, crap. Oh, thank God. Just bugs. I think it is super silly and fun. All right, let's go ahead and let's try out our two other guys. So where's our other Rex? Is this it? Yep, Fulman Rex. Boom. Well, I'm not expecting much from this one because it's a tier one elemental, but I just want to be able to compare, you know, when we battle something with the good one. <laughs> See, this is what I'm talking about. Why does a Rex hit harder than a Broodmother? It will never make sense to me. All right. So 569, I think. Yeah, the roar. Look at that. That is super cool. I like it. I like it a lot. All right. Let's pack you up. I think that will like stun everything in the vicinity or something. I don't know. Um, Let's see. Where's the other racks? Glacial racks. All right. So get ready for hopefully the big damage. Oh, you know what? I didn't have the armor out for any of those guys. I don't even know if we did that for the Broodmother. So the Broodmother would have hit for a little bit more. This is going to be... How much of a power boost is it again? 15% uh, power boost. That's not nothing, you know? Especially when you're dealing with, uh, with these numbers. All right, let's see. And... Yes! The Rex has been the only one that I can think of, like the Rexes, that hit for that much. It is, it's like they're the bosses. Definitely what we want for our upcoming fight. Like, absolutely. Let's just see, does, oh, that's really weird. It's doing the electric move, even though it's an ice guy. That is super weird. But it looks like it lands, guys. Oh, this was going to be... No wonder they chose this for the dragon. No wonder. 
All right, so for level ups, let's go to there and then let's go up that direction. I do want to be careful about that raptor that I'm running towards right now, and it's so stupid that I'm doing so, but yeah, and it gets good power boosts per level up too. So that's sweet. But anyway, guys, I think, I think, oh, it looks so cool in this lighting. I think we did good today. I think we did really good today. Um, this is what we should have done from the beginning is only get Rexes for the boss fights. Let's hope that's our secret. But I'm definitely, you know, I went overkill for the first fight and I thought, oh, this is nothing. The second fight we went, I thought again was overkill, but oh, no, 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 no. We went uh, quite honestly in the wrong direction. I should have tried for like uber overkill again. Oh, look at this pack of raptors. These are all good ones. Awesome. Oh, what are you, bro? Rainbow. Nice. All right. But anyway, thank you so very much for watching. It's been a pleasure. As you always do, please remember to show that amazing support for the series by smashing that thumbs up button. And if you're new to the channel or you haven't yet, seriously, what are you waiting for? It is the perfect time to subscribe. Definitely come hop on over on the Discord as well. Again, the link is down in the description below. I am in there every single day. So come say hi. But uh, other than that, I'll see you guys tomorrow in the next episode. We will definitely, we'll take on either the Broodmother again or definitely the Dragon. I just got to figure out how we're going to deal with that Manicore shenanigans. But anyway, it's been a pleasure. Thanks for watching. If you have any names for my guys, leave them in the comments. And yes, as always, peace out.